Here's the science behind habit formation. Habit formation isn't so much about motivation. It's more about how your brain learns prediction. When you repeat a behavior in the same context, your brain starts to associate that action with the cue, and thereby it releases control from your prefrontal cortex, which is the CEO of your brain, which makes decisions consciously to the basal ganglia, which is the habit center in your brain, which works automatically. And the key chemical here is dopamine, not to start motivation, but more as a neurotransmitter that helps you to keep on going. If a behavior brings relief, progress, or stability, even just a little bit, your dopamine kicks in, making it feel like it's valuable to you, which is why you feel good. So now it's your turn. If there are new habits you'd like to incorporate in the new year, there are three things I'd love you to pay attention to. Number one, have purpose. Because when you know why you're doing something, this gives you positive emotions, which will sustain your energy levels in implementing the habit. Number two, repeat the habit in the same context. This is very important for your brain in terms of prediction. By doing the habit or action in the same context and environment, it helps your brain to link the action with the environment, giving it the cue every time you're in the environment to perform the habit. And then number three, make the habit small, simple, and easy. Remember, your brain learns through repetition, not intensity. By keeping the behavior and the action small and simple, this will ensure that you can actually follow through every single day to make the habit stick. And once you've done it often enough, your brain will take over and make it automatic so you won't even have to consciously think about it.